Hello, Kevin here. And I'm sitting in my summer house in the winter. Perfect. Cup of tea in hand. Let me just have a sip. Lovely. So it's that time of year again where we get our families together and celebrate Christmas. Well, what a year it's been. The group, the Facebook, Kevin's Rambles Facebook group has grown a little bit, which is great. The subscribers on my YouTube channel have also um, <laughs> crawled <laughs> into the 800s, um, which is wonderful. But we've had a successful year, all in all, with the, the walks that everybody uh, has attended, which is wonderful. We've got a, a hardcore of people that come out to to support the walks every month. And I think, you know, I'm, I'm trying to think, have we cancelled a walk this year? I don't think we have, have we? No doubt someone will correct me. <laughs> um, the walks are, well, the group has been two years um, since it formation. Um, we've got 225 followers, I think. I would love that group to grow, as I would my subscribers, as everybody would. Um, and if you want to, please spread the word about the, the YouTube channel, the Facebook group, that would be great. Um, but we've got this wonderful hardcore of people that turn up for these walks, month in, month out. And I cannot thank you enough. See, <coughs> sincerely, it's, it's wonderful. Um, we are going to be looking into the walks a little bit more closely, perhaps early in the new year, uh, Cynthia, Steve and I. Um, there's there's a, heart, a, a group of people that are avid walkers and they can walk pretty quick and, and, and a long way. Um, but there are those that are a little bit more restricted. So we're going to be looking at um, figure of eight walks, if we can get those, um, so that we can do the first part of the walk and then if people want to head back to the start then they can um, that won't be a problem at all again uh, something else we're thinking about perhaps alternating a short a shorter walk one month and then a longer walk for the more uh, fit and able walkers the following month again something we've got to look into very carefully um, so that's fantastic um, when I do my next live, which will be, um, I think, I spoke to Cynthia about this the other day, I cannot remember the date. I think it's going to be the first, possibly the first Sunday um, in January, normal time, eight o'clock. But don't be surprised if I don't jump in there with a, an unscheduled live anyway. It could be anyone. Um, I don't need permission from Cynthia or Steve to do that. I'll just do it. <laughs> um, but I wanted to thank everybody for your fantastic support. Um, and I believe, I think I remember Steve saying that the social side, he made a little speech at the end, at the, um, at the meal in Arundel. And I will come to that in a second. Um, and he said about the social side of it. Yes, I do. Social side of it is very important to me where a couple of times, three times a year, we can all get together and have a, a big group meal together. Um, that is wonderful. Um, people can mingle, they can talk, they have their meals and whatever, um, and that's great. Um, Mark English, thank you very much, sir, for uh, helping out with all, um, um, leading walks. Again, we would love you to do that further uh, again in, in the new year, 2024. Gene Blemings, unfortunately Gene hasn't been able to attend the walks um, for, for personal reasons, and I'm not gonna go into that at all. Um, but it would be great to have Gene back. Um, Queen of Maps, she'll never lose that title. <coughs> and um, let me go touch on the subject of the Arundel walk, which I couldn't attend. Um, there was a particular reason. I know there were certain people that were concerned something had happened to me, and it didn't. Um, my son was taken ill. 
Um, I'm not going to go into details about why. You don't need to know that. That's personal. My son has given me permission to mention the fact that it was him that was taken ill. What I will say is, um, in many respects, we're still we're very lucky to have um, James still with us. It was quite serious. Um, I'm not going to say the hospital's names that he was at, particularly the second one, because people will then be able to Google what that hospital is is um, renowned for, and I'm not going to put that. So, my son is with me at the moment. He's here recuperating. Um, could be quite a long process, I think, but you know, the sooner we can get him up and about, well, he is I'm say up and about. He is up and about, but he's he's. Um, bit restricted what he can do and as someone that's a very active fit 41 year old um, that works extremely hard with his plumbing and heating engineer business um, to be in the, the where he is now um, doing what he's doing trying to recuperate from this this illness that he had um, it's very very difficult and tough it's been a tough um, three weeks for our family <coughs> Um, and as you can probably tell, it has affected me quite badly. I wasn't sure if I was ready to do this or not, but I've got to get through it. I've got to do this because it means a lot to me to be able to thank everybody. <clears throat> I've had fantastic support from Cynthia and Steve. Um, they're always at the end of the phone for me. Um, I will not be contacting them over this Christmas period, even if I do need them. Um, their time for their family is so important to them, and I would not want to interfere at all. <clears throat> so I'm gonna cut this short now, because as you can tell, I'm quite emotional about this. I'm a bit like Andrew Norris at Arundel, <coughs> but, Thank you very much, everybody, for your wonderful continued support. Long may it continue. Um, I want to grow the group. Um, I want to grow the, the YouTube channel. And I cannot do that without your continued support. Um, if anybody's got any suggestions of where we can do a walk, Cynthia, Steve, and I will certainly look into that. Um, we've got a list of as long as my arm of places that we're looking in or, got, or going to look into we will all being well um be doing a walk at the end of january we want to get back into that straight away and i will be there all being well um obviously my son's health uh, allowing um i know people have said to me that are in the group that it wouldn't be a Kevin's Rambles walk without Kevin being there. Well, that's lovely to say that, but there's nothing, there's no reason why the walks cannot still go ahead without me being there. Arundel was um, proof in itself. Um, hopefully I'll be able to do a live. <laughs> um, and not get too emotional about it and not get emotional at all about it. I don't want to be becoming emotional doing a live show. It's bad enough doing this. Anyway, I'm going to leave it at that. Um, to everybody, I wish you a very Merry Christmas and a very happy, safe and healthy New Year of 2024. Anyway, I'm going to have another sip of tea. and wish you all the best. Bye bye for now, and I will see you all very soon. Bye.